<clears throat> well, I was fortunate enough to find out about concretine a few years ago, and then it sort of educated me on graphene. And because one of our main interests in on TRU and in the rail industry in general is to try and reduce carbon, you know, improve the way we construct, etc. And with the recent uh, removal of hardwood sleepers from the railway, etc., it means that you're left with concrete and largely uh, untested composite sleepers, which uh, I'm sure uh, there's a map you can have. But to pick something that works already and just change in from the normal, what I call full fat concrete uh, with the high cement contour, uh, content to uh, the graphene, use of graphene, you know, reducing it down to levels of 10% initially, is it? Um, you know, that's that could potentially come down to a 50 meter intervention, break a significant uh, impact upon the footprint of the railway.